do you define a healthy relationship? Ooh. Define a healthy relationship. Um, a good relationship would be with someone that you really like to be around. I think a healthy relationship is um, defined by someone who you can be totally yourself around, someone you feel comfortable with, um, and more importantly, someone who makes you the best version of yourself. I think a healthy relationship is one that's friction free. Doesn't mean that you don't fight or that you can't disagree about some things, but most of the relationships should be marked by patience and kindness, uh, care for one another. I define a healthy relationship as one that has trust, um, a sense of humor, compromise. You know you can count another person and they're encouraging you to do your best. I think a good friend is real. I think, I think a good friend is one who puts up with you <laughs> and gets you, but is their own person too, that they bring something to the relationship that's a little bit different. A good friend is somebody who will like, laugh with you, cry with you, no matter what the circumstances are. What do you look for in a significant other? Um, I look for the same sense of humor as me and the uh, same taste in music. <laughs> her. Um, I look for someone, I look for my best friend really, um, someone you can be weird with and be comfortable with and who makes you happy. Well, I wanted a woman that would be secure in who she was and uh, be comfortable in her own skin. I was lucky enough to find somebody who shares the same sense of humor and the same taste in music. When I was in college, I didn't have too many girlfriends in college, but I had a girlfriend who, who explained to me that relationships are like pizza. <clears throat> and I thought that was kind of funny until she explained it to me and that made sense. So everybody has their favorite kind of pizza, what they put on their pizza. Um, they've tried different things. Some people really like anchovies. Some people never put Harry Fish on their pizza. But even if you have your favorite pizza, how'd you come to that? So you've tried things that you knew you'd never try again kind of like being in a relationship. There's some people that, some people have a certain attitude or a certain personality, you know, I will never hang out with that kind of person. But maybe you start hanging out with some people and kind of try out like dating and things. Try a certain different personality and say, you know what, I like your sense of humor, but I don't like the way you <clears throat> treat, treat your siblings, right? So that you know next time you get in a relationship that if somebody treats their siblings not so well, you're you're probably not gonna invest a lot of time into that relationship, right? So eventually you're gonna to come to the most perfect pizza and you know what that is because you're thinking about it right now, right? You have some idea of that person that you wanna hang out with right now because of the trials and tribulations that you've gone through, right? But in that way, you've gotta try certain tastes, you gotta try certain flavors, you gotta try certain personalities to know kind of what you want on that perfect pizza. I don't know, I thought it was kind of a cool thing. <laughs>